Howdy, boys and girls. Amanda McDowell here, better known as Mama Mac. Uh, today we're going to be talking about numerical prefixes. These are the things that change. A prefix is a little piece of a word that changes the meaning of another word when you put that little piece of a word before it. So uh, without further ado, let's get started. We'll start with uni, by, try, and quad. Uni means one, by means two. Now in Funky Town, better known as your music room, when we mean two singers, we say a duo or a duet. But in regular English language arts class, if you use the word, if you put like the prefix by before the word sickle, then you have bicycle. You have a cycle, a round thing rolling with two wheels on it. Bicycle. All right. So tri would be three wheels, tricycle. Quad would be four. Like a quarter has is four quarters equal a dollar. Quad is four. Quint, then sex. Oh, I did say that word. Okay, but sex is not that what you're thinking about. Sex in Latin means six. Okay, so quint would be five. Sex would be six. Sept would be seven. Oct is eight, and non is nine. A prefix is a word or group of letters that is placed before a word. A prefix changes the meaning of a word. Some prefixes are used to represent numbers. These are called numerical prefixes. This is what we're talking about today. Uni is one. Uni plus cycle equals a unicycle. That means a bike with one wheel. Think about if you've ever seen somebody rolling around on a bike with one wheel. If you haven't, you can look it up on the internet. It's uh, actually spelled exactly the way that it's written right here. Uni and then cycle. Look it up. By means two. Bicycle. The meaning, a bike with two wheels. Now remember, boys and girls, in, in Funky Town, we call two people singing a duet or a duo, okay? That's different. That's the only word that's different in music land. Three is tri. Tri plus cycle means tricycle, meaning a bike with three wheels. Quad with a raped is a quadruped. Can you say that word? Quadruped? Can you think about what that might mean? I didn't know until I watched this video. It means a an animal with four feet. So your cat is a quadruped. Your dog is a quadruped. If you have a pony, it's a quadruped too. Five babies born at once. Did you know there's such a thing? You can get pregnant and have five babies all at once. Girls, not boys, but just saying. Sex, remember, sex equals six. Sextet is a group of six instruments. Can you say that word? Sextet. Now, also the word sept is an abbreviation for September, but remember we're learning prefixes for numbers, and sept means seven. Septuplets, meaning seven babies born at the same time. Ah, uh, yeah, that's possible too. Eight, 
octo plus puss means octopus, a sea creature with eight arms. Non means nine. Non, a nonagon means a shape with nine sides. And that's the end of this video. So your assignment after watching this video and learning all the prefixes that mean numbers, your assignment is to uh, draw a nonagon. Make a shape with nine sides. And thanks for listening.